Indian national Judith D'Souza, who was working with an NGO in Kabul and was kidnapped last month, has now been rescued. External Affairs Minister Sushma Swaraj has tweeted about this. Judith's family lives in Kolkata and had to spend the last few weeks anxiously waiting for her return with no information available on her whereabouts. 40-year-old Judith, who was working with the Aga Khan Foundation as a senior technical advisor, was kidnapped by suspected militants from outside her office in the heart of Kabul on the 9th of June. She was scheduled to return home in the same week. Her family had written to Prime Minister Modi urging him to help secure her release. And tracking the story for us is my colleague Monudipa Banerjee who now joins us on the phone line from Kolkata. Monudipa, what a huge relief this must be for the family. What more do we know about Judith's condition and also the circumstances of her release? Very little, uh, really. Uh, we just know that she has been rescued because uh, uh, Shushma Swaraj tweeted out early this morning uh, that uh, Judith is in the custody of the Indian government. Uh, the news is absolutely wonderful for the family, for whom it has been a huge, huge strain. Brother uh, Jerome is in Delhi. The family is, I believe, in Kolkata. And uh, they are not speaking at the moment. They have not been speaking for the last month that they have been waited, they have th that they have had to wait for news of Judith. Uh, uh, but obviously, you can imagine absolute joy in the community. Uh, you know, they live in the Anandopalit area of Kolkata, and there is a, it's a very closely knit community out there. And I remember when we had gone to the house uh, when Judith was kidnapped, friends, neighbors. Uh, in fact, uh, you know, many, many people from across the city had come and visited the family, and they are rejoicing. The Kolkata churches will probably hold special prayers because she has been rescued. I've been speaking to her friends, her former teachers, and they are absolutely so relieved. Uh, the, in, you know, what happened to Judith, that is still not clear. Who kidnapped her? Was it the Taliban? Was it some other person? people. Uh, sources suggest that it was other people that the kidnap was perhaps only for ransom. Remember, Judith worked with the Aga Khan Foundation, which is a very uh, big uh, NGO, and uh, it is probably for money that she was kidnapped, but that's not clear yet, not confirmed as yet. Judith, a Kolkata girl, and today's right. Kolkata, I promise you, will be celebrating.